Hi everyone, the Spider-Man here. So before I start today's video, I just want to say a massive thank you to all the people that are following me on Instagram. And you have to bear with me a little bit because I'm still getting used to all its functions. So this is my entire collection. If people have uh, never seen it before and if uh, i got some new lovely subscribers. So yeah, I think it's only a small collection. That's because I have seen a lot, lot bigger than this. So, on the 27th of October, I did a video involving three tarantula malts. Now, that video was a week old, so the three tarantulas are perfectly fine to feed. But unfortunately, I can only feed the one today. Uh, as you know, I'm going to that uh, spider show this Sunday, as I keep mentioning. And I'm going to be getting some nice, large brown crickets for my Pirutholata and my unknown species that uh, malted as well which I think that's a uh, via Salopis. So I'm going to be feeding my green bottle blue today, my C pubescence, which is just down the bottom there. So yeah, let's take the enclosure off the shelf and uh, let's see if she's hungry. So ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, I have my tripod, my 12 inch tongues and my tub full of Mario worms <laughs> or super worms, whatever you want to call them. There's a a fair few still in there. I got these from the uh, the Bristol show. So yeah, I've still got probably a good 12 or 20 around that area. So yeah, let's uh, grab one of these. And uh, let's see if she's hungry. And there she is, ladies and gentlemen. Or sexed female. Green bottle blue. Or superbescence. Not very big. Probably around about the... 2.75 inches, nearly three. So I'm hoping this is a female because uh, the gentleman that I bought it off, he said it was a female. So yeah, let's um, give her a feed. There you go everybody, a nice slow-mo. I haven't done one for a while, so I thought I'd put that into the video for you guys and then you could uh, see how fast she is. So I'm going to play it now in normal speed. So that gives you an indication of actually how fast tarantulas can be. And you can have a lot of species that are very, very skittish. This one's very skittish, so you have to be prepared for them to uh, probably bolt off somewhere. So yeah, as you can see, she's got her male perfectly fine and this should uh, fatten up her abdomen. And if you didn't know what the abdomen is, it's the uh, the bum or the butt. Which is uh, just here. Beautiful, beautiful species. Females are fairly big. They can get to around about six inch leg span. Males are considerably smaller. Males can get to probably around about three, three and a half inches. So, yeah, she's got some fantastic colours. And um, I'd probably give her... Another super worm or Mario worm, probably in the next uh, four or five days. And uh, once she's had three or four of them Mario worms, that will uh, fatten up her abdomen. So there's a closer look at her, everybody. And um, like I said, I will feed the Rufalata and the Via Salopis on Sunday when I come back from the, uh, from the tarantula show. Sorry about the light, it's just because it's uh, really, really sunny uh, today and it's casting a uh, horrible reflection. So while she's eating her meal, everybody, let's take a closer look at the other two tarantulas that malted, my P. Rufalata and my Alvia Salopis. There you go, everybody. 
There's my Pocotheria rufolata, the red slade ornamental. Very small abdomen, but uh, that's to be expected because it's just freshly malted. So, yeah, not very big, probably around about the two and a half inch leg span. So let's take a look at the other one. And there is my unknown species, but as I said, I reckon it's a Lampropalma via salopi. It's not very big, probably around about the two inch leg span. And you can see that blue coloration. So I think it's definitely a via salopis. And if it is, I will be breeding it with my adult female next year. So yeah, two freshly malted tarantulas, or I should say three, sorry. <laughs> So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video everybody and I will feed this one and my Rufalata on Sunday and uh, thanks for watching everyone.